Hello folks, we have a very different thing that we're doing today. It's Retro Palooza. Video games, toys, uh, mostly retro. But yeah, we're here. I'm here with uh, with uh, Rockstar T. Uh, y'all y'all may know him. He's an ex Rockstar drummer and everything. Very very famous person. Uh, we are here with his with his son, and uh, we're gonna see what we're gonna find. Uh, this is the intro. Well, not the intro, but this is the entrance to it. And uh, yeah, let's go. Look at that, folks. We're inside, and you start off with glasses, cups, Pac Man, everything. You know what? We're gonna see what we got. Saturday morning. That's my homie right there, folks. Legendary. And this guy's cool too with his revenge. We've got shirts. Three for sixty. Twenty dollars each. Right there, Texas. It's got a lot of people here. We've got uh, mostly retro games. As you can see, we got toys down here. So if you want Now this right here, folks. That's pretty that's that's not you don't see that every day. Got some Nintendo Metroid. And he even got new stuff. Or newer, I should say. The Streets of Rage 4. Actually, this is limited run with the box. This was kind of cool. But y'all know how I feel about limited run. But I do like the fact that they create their Sorry. own demand. Oh, this one, the Mazen Saga Mutant Fighter. Rare, rare game. It's actually pretty good, too. Love me some Darius. Darius is some good stuff. Y'all haven't been to one of these in a while, folks. Like... I used to come to these all the time, but uh, yeah, we'll see if we'll find anything else. So they also have people that are cosplayers, other YouTube people that are, that are here that are signing, meeting people, saying hello. You got the G to the next level guys here. I mean, generally though, because mine wasn't even a remedy. And it looks like they're selling some of their games here. So uh, not bad, not bad, not bad. You do know about them, right? Not this postman. Because you know how I, you know, you guys know that I have pretty extensive on this stuff. These renovation games were really hard to find for a while. Vapor Trails is a good one. I have this, but not in the box. It's money, but you know. Plus, mine's a repo. And of course, we got more over here. I might just start it over. Like, if I stream it, I might just start it over. Also, man, old Tim. He a dolly side. Now, Tim's awesome. Yeah. Not bad, not bad. We should have got the panel. How's it going? Okay. All right, how you doing? I'd say you should have gotten one, but yeah, Retro Palooza, folks.
Look at that, folks. We have Goku, Squirtle, and... No, it's not Pikachu. I was about to say Pikachu, but no, that's Eevee. Yeah, we're still here. We're still looking. We're still looking at stuff. Uh, we got a lot of cool stuff, man. Um, you know me. I think I found something that is really cool. It's uh, that Hot Wheel set. But, uh, you know, we kill. We're still looking. We're still killing it. We're still seeing whatever they got. Oh, look. Super 7 Voltron. Look at that. And we got another Super 7 over there. But, yeah. Uh, Rockstar T is uh, walking around with his son. We're over here just, uh, you know, taking in the lights. You know, the game chasers. Got to talk with them for a bit. Um, everybody else, you know, that we know. We we were live. If you didn't catch that, look on, on the channel. I posted it up. You can see, uh, you know, some of the shenanigans. And some of the non-shenanigans that we got. Got some Genesis games over here. The labels look a little messed up. All right. And we've got comics. We got Super Nintendo. We got purses. Come on out tomorrow, folks, if you're not here today. Because, uh, you, I mean, look, 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 look. Guys, guys, guys. Here's what you got, okay? You got your video games. And you've got your purses and clothes. <laughs> till you grow, you know, you're like, hey, let's go get yourself something nice, you know? And then in the meantime, you know, you can get her a wallet, you can get her something else, and, you know, some coasters. Girls love coasters. You know? But in the meantime, you can go look at the things that you want to look at. Like, if you're into Wheaties boxes that look like anime characters and everything, you know, some great art. You can get some great plushies. You can get some great toys. You can get some everything great. So come on out. Oh, wow. Look at this, folks. It's not complete, but man. You got the Morphin playset. So you can get that. If you're not into that, you got baseball cards. You like baseball cards? You got baseball figures? You got some old school toys over here? Yeah. So, yeah. It's more than just video games. You know, it's a, it's a celebration. It's a celebration of great things. Oh, wow. Look at this. Oh, wow. These are actually full in the box. That's sweet. That's sweet. Oh, we're at it again. We're at it again. Yes, we're at it again. Yeah, we. Oh, wow. We got vapor trails over here, folks. Oh, is it just a box? It's just a box. Okay, okay, okay. I thought it was going to be full game. I mean, I'm going to repeat myself again. I started off with the Genesis stuff, retro games, collecting all that before I got into the Hot Wheels and everything like that. So this, huh, this is uh, stuff that makes me, it makes me happy. I grew up with this and it makes me really happy and I'm just battling because, you know, I'm trying to make this interesting for folks and it also surprises me how expensive some of this stuff got while I've been you know doing my own thing because your boy does have that but he didn't pay that for it but yeah what else do we have over here got a table of uh, oh wow Got Deanna Troy, Dinan. Oh, I wonder. Are we going to see Kern, Worf's brother? I don't see it. I don't see it, folks. And doesn't look like he has much uh, stock back there. So, yeah. We, yep, don't see it. One of these days, I'm, a, I'm not going to buy I know I can buy it online. But it's just the fun of the chase, man. You know, you got to chase it down. Sometimes you just got to chase for what you want. Instead of just cutting corners and buying it online. Right? Right. <laughs> but yeah, so Retro Palooza, video games, and everything extraordinary you see. 
Everyone's still making their deals. People bring in some trades, trying to get things. I did hear this. One of the tables had a little Samson and a panic restaurant. And a guy came up and he goes, I want those two games. And he dropped, no lie, folks, no lie. He dropped $3,200 on that game. Two games. Not one game, two games. I used to have Panic Restaurant, and I had that, and I sold it years ago when I needed money. I mean, we're talking years ago. Probably back in like 2011? No, 2012. And it wasn't going near, near around that much. And now for that game and Little Samson, Someone paid three thousand and two hundred dollars. That, my friends, is quite amazing. If you, if I do say so myself, that is quite amazing. But yeah, I think we're uh, winding down to see what we want to buy here. We've. Uh, Scoped out all the tables, scoped out the deals. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna tell you folks, there's one time I could have got this game. Cartridge by itself. Cartridge by itself. It was selling for $120. And I told myself, I was like, no, 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 no. That's gonna go down a price. That's gonna go down a price. No one's gonna want this game that bad. $120 and I missed it. What did I do? Now look at it. Look at it. Look at it. See? Things that you learned in the past. Plus, at the time, I was like, I don't know if I want to spend that much on a game. That's the other thing. At the time, I was like, I don't know if I want to spend that much. And, well, now, as you saw, 16 hundred dollars makes sense because it's really 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 rare it was released at the very end of the life cycle of the genesis and yeah you snooze you lose seeing if I, anything else that we do not have in this collection nope that's on you know we keep moving on but like i was saying before i saw that crusader Cinti there we have seen a couple of things that we're interested in. Uh, Mr. OK Chief is one of the ones I'm going to buy stuff from. Like I said, go follow him. Oh, wow, this is cool. Go follow OK Chief because uh, he's, he's greatness. Oh, there's, there's the rock star right there with his son. Rockstar's coming. So, so uh, rock star, how you doing? Drop, dropping some money. Plushies. Yeah. You know what? Ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong. But uh, you know, sometimes you just gotta. Oh, and then uh, there's another man right there, Mr. DRG, Dallas Retro Gaming. He's uh, running this booth right here, making deals. Oh wow. We're gonna look at some boxed NES games. Little thing. My friend Asheen and I used to rent this game so much. This game was horrid. But for some reason we thought we are going to beat this. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna get this. I don't know how many weekends we rented that crappy game to try to figure out if we could get if we could you know, just get high scores on them. This game is fun. Y'all ever play Bad Dudes? The soundtrack on it was... Uh, and then you could barely hear them say, I'm bad, at the beginning. It was more like, I'm bad. I might, find, I, I might try to find that. 
If I can find that, I'll put that in uh, in the video. But um, yeah, Roadrunner. We got some good stuff here. This biggest marketing ploy in the world. So yeah, like I said, we're uh, everything's winding down. Oh look. We got some some YouTube royalty right here coming through. How you doing? How you doing? We're live. We're live. <laughs> but yeah, we got Boogie here. Game Chasers right there. Hold on. See if I can zoom in on Billy a little bit. Look at him. Look at him trying to act like he's all sexy, schmexy like. <laughs> but anyways, yeah. We're almost done here. We're figuring it out. We're uh, there's probably going to be an after party that uh, Billy told me about, and I might go. But yeah, that's pretty much Retro Palooza in its in its greatness. We've uh, like I said, oh, um, I'm gonna go buy some things. I might put that on the video at the end to see what we buy, but. As I said, man, if you don't, if you're not in Dallas, come to Dallas, come to Arlington, and uh, you know, come on Sunday. Don't worry about the, don't worry about the Cowboy game. You don't, you don't need to worry about that. Just come out, see my boys, and uh, buy yourself some stuff. Until the next one, we'll see. You.